On this episode of Chris Jones Speaks, I'm talking, I have to talk to my 2K family. I have to talk to my 2K followers. I have to talk to the people who have subscribed to this channel because of the 2K content that it produced. I am sorry to announce to you that my retirement from 2K is official. The retirement from the 2K community, the series, the uploads is official. Unfortunately, the decision has been made for this because of just the overall production of 2K life for me. Uh, 2K used to be the only game I've ever played. It used to, it was a point in time when that game was the only game that got any burn on my console, you know, and, and, and as I aged and, you know, different games started to come out and different things started to get played, my attention started to draw elsewhere. And then the 2K community became extremely toxic. And I would only speak personally, I'm just going to speak on the next gen when next gen became a thing, not Xbox one next gen but PS5, Xbox Series S and X, when those gens of 2K have came out, everything changed, you know? We had 21 next gen, which was probably the second worst 2K of all time. And then we've had 2K22 next gen, and now we're on 23 next gen. And it's just safe to say, man, that the enjoyment out of playing that game is no longer there. It's no longer there. Um. There were some telling signs very early on prior to this retirement that would let you know that it may be time to invest into something else, invest your time into another game. Because during the, you know, the playing period of 2K, you know, during that playing period of the game, uh, it it just didn't turn out too well. You know, it. It just didn't turn out too well during that playing period, um, especially over the last couple years. It's been less and less, you know, with 21 Next Gen. I constantly played that game. It's crazy. I constantly played 21 Next Gen, but I wasn't really enjoying it, but I was playing it, you know. And then when 22 Next Gen came out, that's when everything kind of shifted. Like that was the first time that I took an extended break from playing 2K and it didn't really like do anything. Like it, it wasn't like I was sitting there wanting to play 2K. I just, something else had my attention. Warzone had my attention and figuring that out kind of took away the 2K thing. But now we get to 23 and this is the most productive I can probably honestly say this is the, probably the most productive this channel has been or I have been personally because how of the time that I'm utilizing now you know there is no urge to play 2k anymore there is no urge that urge is gone there there is no urge to level up a player max out any badges have rec runs have park runs or anything there's no urge for that anymore and I, I want to blame it on age I, I do i really want to blame it on age I, ever since i've turned 26 you know 2k has just been more and more of a of a good memory over like a reality and ever and but i'm not gonna blame it on the age i don't even and, and the crazy thing is i'm not even gonna blame it on the community or the developers or anything i just think that i have been i have gotten sick and just tired of the concept of 2k basketball as a whole you know at least and, and and you know what's crazy it may not be forever but if i return to 2k it may be with another mode it may be with uh, another mode or another style of the game but as far as like you know playing career and you know getting on career and playing career all the time and stuff like that that's over man the career mode the grinding my players the you know all of that that that's over with that's over and that's done you know now that i'm sitting here and i'm actually talking to you guys i guess i could you know kind of branch out and pro probably do some like franchise uh not franchise but what do they call it in 2k my gm or my league or just maybe some rank match game player maybe even my team but even then it's like i'm just doing that right now because there's no like there's nothing really for me to play right now. Uh, I know Call of Duty has just dropped and everything, but you know, I've already found my gun. <laughs> I've already found my gun that I'm gonna 
use uh, during the start of you know, the war zone season. So there's really no point in me playing multiplayer anymore. I have my gun maxed out. I have the attachments that I need for that gun to be the most effective, you know? Um, so really it's just, this is really just the time I'm using to really just get content out every single day. And you know, that's kind of where the, the direction of the channel is going. And that that's the next topic that I wanted to talk, talk on is direction of the channel. If you were here because of the rant from 2K or my thoughts on 2K and everything like this, like that, this would be your time to unsubscribe if you're going to unsubscribe because you won't be getting any of that. You won't be getting any 2K rants or 2K thoughts or way I feel about a community and all that other stuff that's finished those days are done so if that's what you're here for then I would say unsubscribe from the channel now if now if you're here because you actually like the content that I put up then continue to continue to stay subscribed and continue to just be on the lookout because content will drop content will be dropping but nonetheless man at the end of the day this is just my message to you to let you know that I'm stepping away from 2K content for a while. Uh, I don't know when I would. I don't know when it will be back. I don't know uh, how or the I don't know how it's going to come back or when it will come back if it does come back. But this is just really a quick episode. Really, I could have made this a video, but. I just need another podcast episode to be honest with you, but this is just a quick little announcement to let you know that we'll let the 2K family know the direction of the channel. Um, I, I really don't have too much else to say. I just really thought that I should let you guys know for those who may have been wondering where's the 2K rants, where the 2K videos at. You're not, you're not getting any, <laughs> you're not getting any. So with that being said, I really hope you guys um, stay. I do. I, I really do hope that some of the subscribers stay and just take a, a chance at some of the different content that's going to drop for the channel. But I understand if you're going to go because you're here for one reason, one reason only. But nonetheless, the channel is in a transition stage. As you can see it by the start of this video, I titled I started it by saying the crit chris jones speaks uh because i i'm removing the it's and i'm changing it's to i'm to kind of you know more personalize the channel a bit so the channel name has been changed to i'm chris jones but you know logos and things of that nature is gonna have to get added throughout time um but the channel is definitely in a transition stage content will still be dropping no doubt we still would be dropping content every day but as far as the 2K side of the, of the channel, that side is pretty much obsolete or dead or extinct. Um, but that's just pretty much it. You know, I, I'm just, I just wanted to let you guys know personally, so you don't have to wonder where's the 2K vids at it anymore. Uh, they won't be here, but you will still be getting Madden and Call of Duty gameplays, you know, every day, every day for like the next month, two, three months maybe four months it'd just be straight content um but like i said man as far as 2k goes 2k is dead so with that being said chris jones is signing out